SGC here, and we're back. Peter Rabbit, directed by Will Gluck, stars Daisy Ridley, Rose Byrne, James Corden, Sam Neill, Dom Hal Gleason, and uh, the Becky, and uh, Margot Robbie. Tons of that stuff. Lots of people. So looking forward to that. Um, the original first trailer that came out, I wasn't intrigued. It was just more like, whoa, 3D Peter Rabbit. Not digging the sass, but once I found out that it was like a live action 3D animated film, I was like, oh, interesting. And then we got the cast, and I was like, whoa. And Tom Gleason, Rose Byrne, being the live actors, looked like a pretty fun show. And uh, check it out. And also now it's with controversy because it's like the allergy stuff blowing it up. So uh, hopefully I'll watch it, and then you can bring your kids to to see this allergic bunny rabbit show. Anyways, I look forward to it. it looks kind of fun. Something easy to digest type of thing laugh here and there hopefully i'll laugh anyway that's it this is before and this is after oh man okay first off this is like you need to watch this because the animation the 3d is just amazing like the fur and the movement the choreo holy crap the four birds that sing and rap and everything the dance choreo just for that it's worth the price of entry and then you have the actual story and the voice acting daisy really oh my goodness hilarious dom hal gleason hilarious all the gags that are repetitive like the physical one where they hook up the electricity to like the door handles and everything that was in the trailer but it was still hilarious and just all around great fun i mean roseburn give or take what have you could have could have been replaced by anybody but dom hal gleason great performance great chemistry amongst just the cast, um, like we got the family of four and then we got the random animals back and forth and it just feels genuinely like realistic with them wearing clothes, it's not like a silly sort of campy thing but rather it's just like you accept it and, and you go with it and it's just like so much fun and yeah I laughed out loud a few couple of times. The allergy joke, I mean they, they I don't know like it's done well like they, they recognize that allergies are dangerous and he had an EpiPen so I mean just it's it's making a joke in the sense of like that's how people some people see allergies and like I'm gluten free or whatever and then I'm just like everything and you just can't have anything and you just get sick of people saying they're allergic to things just for the sake of being allergic but then you know at the same time you these people are real and by the same time you have people that are just allergic to everything for the sake of being allergic but anyway enjoyable much fun really love the animation because i swear i would totally just rewatch this strictly for the animation and De daisy ridley's cottontail character she's just great fun and just hilarious to be around and uh yeah it was just, it was just great fun and uh good good atmosphere and good vibes all around so um definitely enjoyed it much more than i thought i was going to so definitely worth your time i mean don't don't boycott this because of the whole allergy it's not worth your while to not enjoy this great Peter Rabbit fun film and it also sort of ties back to Beatrix Potter as well and do it in a great really nice way and it's a pretty dark film of just setting up like the family death and all that stuff so I mean it's, it's not all family and friends so there you have it Peter Rabbit enjoyable take your kids just watch it yourself I mean if you've grown up reading Peter Rabbit I think it's a different sort of vision by the same time it is a fun one and uh worth your while so there you go that is it but it's before and after for peter rabbit later